Hey guys and welcome back to Popcorn and Piggy. I'm doing a, another cage tour today because these guys have now been cleaned out and I will link to the other cage tour that we did but I thought I would show you Rolo and Miko's cage this week. So we have gone for a red theme, red and yellow I guess are the colours with a little bit of pink but what have we got so we have this wonderful metal house which has a side entrance there and this lovely big entrance here which Miko is eating a carrot within and we've got like a willow stick hello yes hello <laughs> we're arguing over the last piece of carrot which is the usual way Aww. <laughs> so Mika has come leaps and bounds so, since being in this slightly um, higher cage so you will see like the, the other boys are underneath and these guys are up on top so Miko has been literally coming on leaps and bounds in terms of tameness whilst he's at this higher height which is very interesting he would never have come out like this had he have been on the floor like he was before look he's a little bit scared still but it has been helping so let's continue this was in their first cage that they ever had were well, back when i started this channel when i had gus gus and rocky this metal house came with the first cage that i ever had which was basically like a store-bought cage but it had a metal run as well so it was a really really big cage i'll see if i can find a picture and put it on the screen um but this house came with it um, I no longer use even the run or the cage that I had with this. I still have it, but I just don't use it. Um, but I do use the house still because the house is incredible because it, they love that side entrance. We then have our latest haul items. So we have the Piggy Crash Mat and the Piggy Circus Tent from Hey Pigs. Again, I will leave a link right now on the screen and in the description to the Hey Pigs haul that we did. I then have this plastic house which again was when I first got my guinea pigs but it's a really nice one and the boys tend to like these plastic houses for some reason still but yeah we still use them so that is in there just as another overclosed um, one uh, should they need it so we've all got all everything fleece you see apart from the bath mat is homemade Um, yeah got a little sort of bell ball here they're eating their vegetables at the moment. This is a just a lap, um, fleece lap pad. This is actually for the fleece Heidi's that I had made by Squeak Dreams. I'm not using these at the moment just in case it's a little bit warm for them because we are in the summer over here. But during winter, these are a staple and the boys love to snuggle in them. Um, so that's what that is, but I'm just using it there in case the water bottle leaks. And then we have the kind of Corex slash plastic uh, tablecloth homemade hay litter tray with hay bags filled with luscious hay and the bedding that I use here is Orbios and um, the boys these two especially you will see that this has just been tidied and it is still immaculate because these two aren't you especially Rolo are the tidy boys these boys do look after their cage to the point where I could probably clean the fleece once a week in their cage because they are so clean and tidy the only reason i don't is because miko is long haired then obviously to a certain degree he does molt um and so it's only because of the hair on it that i do change it probably more often i will stretch it out as far as i can i tend to do it every four days sometimes i can do it longer sometimes i do it shorter but all the um house kind of fleece items so that one there and that one there they get changed out every day or every other day same as the lap pad in there um depending how bad they are but yeah these two are incredibly tidy look at this look all the orbios is inside unlike our other cage tour of digger and finn from last week where they just made a mess literally within seconds so yes these two are eating their dinner let's get a close up huh? <laughs> But yeah, so that has been this cage tour video. Just a very, very quick one to show you the theme that we have gone for in this week's video. If you liked it, 
please make sure you like the video subscribe so that you do not miss any of our other videos we upload once a week on a tuesday and of course leave me a comment with what you think your guinea pig would enjoy from this cage would it be the metal house would it be a fleece house would it be a plastic house or would it be the epic hay basket area litter tray and would they be clean and would they be tidy let me know see you all next week bye 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 <laughs>